Logan Kane here, and welcome to episode 48 of Paper Sorcerer. Looks like we got two ways to go. Yeah, let's try and take a left. And that's straight into combat. What if I go straight? Straight into combat. Is that what this is going to be now? Just combat after combat after combat? Oy vey. Maybe I should just fast forward to the end of this series. This is... <laughs> this is getting old. Very quickly. But yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be right back. Well, um, I, I, I don't know. I really don't know. What kind? So I can be like, hey, go, go, go. And then they're like, hey, guess what? All your guys are asleep. There's no real defense against that. And as soon as my guys are asleep, it, it, I'm just slaughtered. Ah, uh, whatever. And we're back. I'm just going to include the resting and saving as part of the fast forward part cuz what's the point this this is really getting to be the point where i don't it's becoming not fun i leveled up my guys adequately i pumped them full of stats and now it's like why why does every fight have to be well sure i can win but only if they don't kill me immediately and at any point really they can just destroy me. Sure, maybe I should be focusing on a specific enemy, like this guy here, and this guy here, because I think the- no, this guy, in the back, he does the sleep. No, I killed him right away the first time, so I guess the druids do sleep too, so whatever. I'll be Seriously, these fights, it's like, what, this is just not fun anymore. They, they really feel like, well, if I don't destroy them within three rounds, there's a good chance I'm just completely screwed, regardless of what goes on. And hopefully there's not too many more battles, I just want to get this, I just want to get this over with at this point. Look at this, a chest that I can't interact with, okay, glad that's there. Good lord, if I had to fight to get to that guy, or get to that guy, if I had to have a fight to get to that chest, I would have had a problem. So it looks like there's a lot, I bet there's a monster behind, oh, there's not, oh, there, oh, what the fuck? He's way the hell over there. Whatever, back. Alright. Ooh, I got a Master of Thorn Rune. Plus 25 to 35 damage? That sounds pretty amazing. Although I'm gonna go ahead and save him. You see how far away that guy was? That's, there's no reason he should have been able to attack me. I suppose I should equip the Minotaur with that rune, though. Oh, that 50 defense is very important. Never mind. But he is an AoE guy. Oh, well. It is true that the defense doesn't seem to be helping too much. I was going to say, if I can't get to these, I'm going to be really upset. Um, wow, that's got a lot of stuff on it. Which I don't care. I'm probably going to sell it. Try and max out everything, I guess. Even though these guys don't... I don't know what more I can do. Other than a maxed out defense, I guess. But yeah, I'm going to take a huge risk here. I'm going to just continue on. I am so sick of going back and forth. Gathered in this room are a group of low-level heroes from the lower floors. 
Just because we're not as experienced as some of the others here doesn't mean we can just sit around. We all gotta try our best to stop you. With an inspired shout, they rush forward, brandishing their weapons. So is this gonna be just a slaughter? Is that the idea here? Oh yeah, this is gonna be a slaughter. Dude, there's a hedge wizard? That's funny. Well, I suppose we'll hit the shaman. That makes most sense to hit first. And a good old power swing will probably eliminate all of them. Maybe, just maybe, they're doing this so we feel better about basically being completely screwed this entire time. I don't know what to do with this guy. I'll just attack. And then, of course, we're going to do an ice storm, because why wouldn't I? Great, evaded. Let's see what Power Swing does. Yeah, they're all dead. All of them. I don't, I don't see how any of them could survive, except maybe this warrior dude up front, but... They, they've they've probably they, they've got to all be gone. Let's see. Yeah, even he's gone. Ooh, there's a dwarf behind him. Dwarf? Nope. They're all dead. That, that guy survived. I don't even know what he is, but this ice storm will probably kill him. Yep, he gone. Again, even though it's a terrible idea, I think I'm gonna just continue on. I'm going to say, that's sure shit. But, that's okay. Huh. Yeah, that's, that's that one. Okay. Well, anyway. Damn it. This should be going back to the other room. Yep. Alright, so we're mostly, we have most of it cleared out now. Just gonna grab, gonna loot this stuff. It's mostly worthless. There's some potions, but I don't have time to use potions. It's better to do damage than use a potion in this game. Much better to do damage. You know, I really don't feel like repeating anything anymore. This game has just gotten ridiculous. I don't mind a challenge if there's a counter. There's no counter to the com- Let's see, what's this combination? Uh, I might be able to get through this. I'm not very confident. Skill. Let's get, let's get a charging fist. What do we got? What's the most important one to take out? The man-at-arms. Power swing? Power swing. I got enough for a power swing, so that's what I'm going to do. The cultists really... You know, I think that would be a huge boon. As soon as I tell you, you'll know what I'm talking about. If I were able to, say, use my cultists and give energy to other characters, or even if it was a different character class that gave energy back, that'd be awesome. But maybe I just chose the worst of the characters. Because the puppet, while cool, too much, too much thought. Way too much thought. Hopefully this power swing takes care of things pretty quickly. Okay, it did do a good amount of damage, so it might be enough to... It might be enough to push him over. Wow, his... The cultist's regular attack does a lot more damage than his smite skill. Oh, great. And, uh, agility down. That's what I want. Here, fuck you guys. Get an agility down yourselves. Ooh, and a kill. And another kill. Okay, it looks like we're gonna survive this one. And then somehow he has some weird skill, some esoteric skill I wasn't aware of. Just destroy, destroys me next turn. I'd be so upset. Well, do a defensive strike then. And the, where's that room? Uh, Black Bolt. Black Ball -um. And then, I guess we'll do a regular attack. And I'm definitely going to have to go recharge after this fight. Well, maybe. I'll... I'll stall. Looks like nothing's... I'm gaining levels pretty quickly. Ooh, blast your foes while healing the user. So it's like defensive strike, so whatever. Nothing, 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 nothing. But yeah, I'm leveling up really quick. Maybe I am underleveled. Maybe they just suddenly decided, you know what? You need to be level 45 for this area. Even though last, like two areas ago, you only needed to be 20-ish. Uh, ooh, that's the exit? Have I explored everything? Yeah, I think I did. Well, I could have come straight through over there. 
Alright, good. I, I didn't want to have to start fast-forwarding the video here to go heal up, because that would have been lame. But I think this is going to... You know what? No. No, no, no. We're going to save first. I'm terrified. Because I'm expecting the end of the game to be soon. And for all I know, I'm going to go up one of these stairs and I'm going to be like, ha ha ha, and then I die. And I'll be really upset. Please be a binding. Please be the binding. It is not the binding. Uh, shoot. Well, that's it for episode 48 of Paper Sorcerer. See you next time.